What is S genuinely terrifying fact? There is a species of caterpillar, Big Blue out of Great Britain I believe, that tricks ants into thinking it's an ant queen in distress. The ants take this caterpillar back to the nest where the caterpillar continues acting like a queen but devouring all the ant larvae. This destroys the ant colony from the inside. There are some studies that can point to this species actively finding which larvae will eventually become the next queen and devour those larvae first. The 10 hottest years on record have all been since 2010. We are not only going to see the catastrophic 2 degree warming this century we're probably going to see more than that. The absolute worst part? Even with net zero emissions by 2070 we will still probably see 2 degree warming. The time for action to prevent catastrophe was over maybe 20 years ago we are living in a time of disaster management. You and everything you know is located on a rock going impossibly fast through a void that you can traverse without specialized equipment. You are trapped, and you have no idea why you are here or why you even exist. The only true escape is death. The most terrifying part is that you are aware and reflective and like every other animal and have no tools to answer. Not only why but how. I know it's basic as fuck but death and the very likely chance that everything just ends keeps me up at night. Also the fact that no matter what everyone you love will die. Your parents will die. Your cousins. Your aunties. I would kiss almost comforting that at the end of the day I don't have to worry too much because eventually none of it matters, but I'd kiss scares me. Beetlejuice the red super giant near the constellation Orion supernova back in the 1500s. This October. We will witness the explosion of a star that would have encompassed all planets to the orbit of Saturn. That is a blip on a cosmic scale. It took 600 years for a light to travel through space, showing just how small we really are. Assuming you live in a structure that can burn, a fault in your electrical system can burn your house down at any moment. I grew up in a neighborhood of older houses, several of which burned to the ground usually during the overnight hours. The cause of almost all of them was electrical. Ah people support people of higher status and doesn't matter if you are right or will villainize you even if you are right and kind. But you will realize everyone functions on the basis of us. RKF interest in morality is bullshit nothing but to build a virtuous image. Our national debt is out of control and politicians keep passing the buck. It can't go on and we are on track to crash harder than Venezuela. That's a fact look at the national debt clock. See how much your debt portion is. It will have to be paid by someone. It is not sustainable. That we need to work for 11 months to get one month off in a whole year. That most of people need to work at a shitty job until they retire and then struggle to survive on a small retirement. I mean, a bunch of shit that is terrifying. Billionaires don't pay taxes that etc. There could be someone in your social circle note I didn't say friend group that hates you enough to kill you, and you probably won't see it coming. Most murder victims knew their killer. And they obviously didn't see it coming either. What makes you any different? The Permian extinction was the greatest extinction event in history. The atmosphere was full of CO2 and the oceans warmed so much they held too little oxygen to support most of the life that lived in it. We are currently recreating these events through climate change. We can't save Earth for all of humanity anymore. Most efforts now are for show to avoid people panicking and to quietly prepare for large areas of the world to become uninhabitable. But before that happens, we'll fight horrific wars for resources. How the sun will die, and what will happen to Earth as it goes. We will leave this planet or go extinct. Hopefully we can get past the limitations of faster than light travel by then. We only have 500 million years, so maybe there's time? People who have Neanderthal DNA tend to have a gene variant that allows for better coagulation. Great for fighting woolly rhinos, less so when it starts misfiring and giving you random blood clots requiring emergency surgeries. Don't know if it's a fact, but it seems we stopped voting for cause, and vote for color instead. So allegiances or alignment don't matter, as long as your color wins. Think that is big part of why so many places are fucked. As far as we energy in the universe will eventually reach maximum entropy and all coherent patterns will be lost, if you have a soul. It will die too at some point in the future. The fact that we know more about outer space than our planet's deep oceans is unsettling. There are countless mysteries and potentially terrifying discoveries awaiting beneath the ocean's depths. Sun eruptions happen before and lead to blackouts across several continents. All fun and games in the 19th century. Today it could easily kill millions. And it could happen any hour. That time is passing as we speak. And in a blink of an eye the day has passed, the week, the month. A year has passed. And there's nothing you can do about, only what you do with it. Whatever happens in the afterlife may not treat us kindly.
Maybe afterlife is just eternal hell, and there is no heaven. It is cliche but I think you beat this sometimes and it's scary. Democratic decision making cannot stop, let alone reverse, anthropogenic climate catastrophe. Conversely, the people of 2580, will read about what was a system that saved us. After a full nuclear exchange, some land masses will become devoid of life. The British Isles would depopulate as famine, disease and radiation would kill the remaining survivors. Most elites know that by extracting resources on our planet, it will kill us and fire back from nature. The problem is most of them don't care and they are blinded by greediness. The earth was around billions of years before we were, and is indifferent to our survival. There have been multiple mass extinctions in the past and we shouldn't feel any safer. Life expectancy in the West is about 80 years. 960 months. 4,160 weeks. 29,220 days. 701,280 hours. On this planet. With these people. God help us all. That the decapitated body of an animal still kicks and struggles for a few seconds. That scares me how death is going to be much more painful than we think. You used to be able to take basically anything on an airplane including chainsaws and these days you get cavity searched if you have a Dasani water bottle. It is physically possible to be so constipated that your stool will back all the way up your digestive tract and you can vomit feces. You are welcome. The United States police force doesn't care about enforcing laws that protect its citizens and quite often violate those laws for their own benefit. That somebody is out here trafficking humans and then going back to their family while living comfortably in a much nice place than some of us are. That this entire thread is going to be poached and stuck on TikTok with a weird robot voice and some kind of video game playing in the background. The last official government execution by guillotine was September 10, 1977 at 4.40 a.m. in Marseille, France. That's, during my lifetime. Creutzfeldt Jacob disease mad cow can lie dormant for more than 50 years, is universally fatal, and is inheritable. There is no cure. That we can literally end at any given second to a number of warheads, an asteroid, volcanic eruptions, black holes. The fact that there's this thing called fatal insomnia. It can happen to anyone at any time. And there is no stopping it. A large number of people think a certain orange guy is currently president and running things. But also needs money. Your immune system doesn't know your eyes exist. If it ever finds out, it will eat your eyes and you will go blind. 50-70 of people don't have an internal monologue. I can't even imagine that. I can barely turn mine off to sleep. The map of the world used to have a northern ice cap and a southern ice cap. Now it only has a southern ice cap. Some scientists consider flies the most dangerous of all animals because of how easily they spread illnesses. Barring a few very one-off. Mostly unverified cases rabies virus has a 100 kill rate, if left untreated. That there are people in this world who have absolutely zero support, and absolutely zero people to count on. Donald Trump can legally run for president and is by far the leading candidate for the Republican nomination. Regardless of what you believe or think you know, we actually have no fucking clue to how existence came to be. One day we all will unreveal the mystery of what happens after dying. Think about that. OJ Simpson still hasn't caught the true killers and they could still be out there hunting for sport. S. There's an unknown number of lost. Like where did it go? Lost nuclear bombs just lost around the globe. You could have rabies right now, you won't know until you start showing symptoms. Then, it's too late. We have already released 90 of the carbon we can to limit global temperature increase of 1.5 degrees. Either we're the only sentient species in the whole universe or we are not. Both is equally terrifying. Government statistics state South Africa has an HIV rate of around 25. In reality it's closer to 40. That some Americans still support Trump, let alone believed in that scum grifter in the first place. 1000 years from now humanity and almost everything we created will most probably cease to exist. That people choose to live in perpetual forgetfulness even after they've glimpsed the truth. There is thousand kilometers of magma and it's hotter than sun surface under your foot. The plastic tips at the end of shoelaces are called aglets. Their true purpose is sinister. That two Scottish doctors originally invented the first chainsaw prototype for childbirth. The US military has lost several nuclear weapons and not all of them have been recovered. If you cut off a snake's head it can live independently from the body for up to 7 minutes. That brain aneurysms usually does not have symptoms and it can kill you if it ruptures. Africa will eventually become the only habitable landmass on earth after nuclear war. That most of these replies are exactly the same and we're all wasting our time here. Your car's extended warranty may be about to expire. 
We've been trying to reach you. There's a ghost in your machine and it's gonna spook you when you least expect it. The odds of getting killed by a fellow Redditor is slim to none. But never zero. Knife. Sneering face. Knife. Your dog will wait a few days to eat you if you died. Your cat. Maybe a few hours. A single nuke launch could end the world, and it's relatively easy to set one off. If we don't find an optimal way to travel through space, we'll become extinct. Male otters will rape baby seals and hold each other's pups hostage for food. 99.99999 of the universe is empty space. Even your own body is mostly space. The Appalachian Mountains are older than bones. Sharks are older than trees. From the moment you're born, you are on the march forward towards your death. Donald Trump is the presumptive Republican nominee for president in 2024. At one point in the cremation process a deceased is perfectly cooked. USA is 247 years old. Every great empire has fallen by 250 years. The possibility that Donald Trump could be voted into the presidency. At any given time a rock can crash into the planet and kill us all. The multiverse is likely to be fact according to quantum mechanics. That mankind is the single biggest threat to our own extinction. The trajectory of history is defined by murderous narcissists. Trump was the 45th president of the United States of America. Vacuum decay in space is possible and would have no warning. The panels of the echidna have four heads. You're welcome. On land, you're never more than 5 meters away from a bug. That there are roughly 8 billion people on this planet. That we are either alone in the universe or we are not. If you offend someone, they can ruin your life nowadays. Americans elected emancipation as their president. There are more bones and gummy worms than real worms. 